After midnight shots and cocktails, even liquor store purchases are set to become a thing of the past in West Suburban Cicero, and it's not sitting well with bar and restaurant owners. It's cutting us down by three hours, and unfortunately, that's when we have the most traffic. I mean, people like to sit down and eat, enjoy a beer, and, you know, relax. But Cicero's leaders say what's happening inside bars and restaurants into the wee hours of the morning is spilling into the streets, straining police and disrupting the community. Over the last, uh, I don't know, maybe eight months, we've noticed an increase in uh, problems, fighting, violence, uh, noise, um, van, you know, damage. The solution to what leaders say is alcohol induced chaos is written in this new town ordinance passed Tuesday morning, banning the sale of any liquor after midnight, effective January 1st. Lucy Valdez co owns two bars and restaurants that she says will be stunted. By denying all of these, you know, the alcohol sales by reducing that, it's going to affect us drastically. I mean, are we talking tens of thousands of dollars figures? Uh, yes, of course. Currently, bars in certain restaurants can serve liquor until 3 a.m. on weekends. One of Valdez's bars doesn't even open until 9. I would feel like we would get to the point where we would need to close our business because you can't run a bar from 9 to 11.30. It's going to affect a lot of jobs in Cicero. I mean, that's what the part that they're not thinking about. This new ordinance will affect roughly 110 establishments. Bar and liquor store owners say they're hoping to rally together to make changes before it takes effect in January. A spokesperson for Cicero's president says he's willing to have those meetings.